Hey guys, I'm Ryan45678, and I know a lot of you have probably seen and heard a lot about the Tale of Kingdoms mod for the PC version of Minecraft, and I've always wanted to try it, but I've never been able to get it to work. So today I was messing around with it for a few hours, and I finally got it to work. But it works on my computer, and I tried to do it on my brother's computer, but I couldn't get it to work for some reason, so... If it doesn't work on your computer, uh, I don't know. I just hope it does. So to start off, make a new folder, call it Minecraft Mods. Okay, and the first thing that you're gonna uh, first thing you're gonna want to do is download um, Minecraft no MC Nostalgia so you can either Google search it like I'm doing or I'll give you the link in the description It should be the Minecraft form link. Come on. And it'll be... Where is it? That's not it. Two point one point two. Uh, will be the Minecraft form link. This is the right one, and then the link is right here, and it's AdFly. So be careful what you click. Make sure you only click what I click. This one's not too bad, so, but the others are, or they can be. Okay, good, it worked. Wasn't sure because on my brother's computer it showed up as some weird file, but it still said zip, and it wouldn't let me extract it. Okay, so now, um, drag that into our Minecraft mods folder, and extract into the same folder and just make sure when you open it you do this one the one that's not a zip folder and I guess I should install Minecraft on this this login so I'll do that real quick Okay, so while I'm doing that, I'll tell you what else you'll need. You'll need, of course, Minecraft, the MC Nostalgia, uh, Mod Loader 1.2.5. I'll show you how to get to it. Um, Magic Launcher, and I'll show you how to get to that too. And the Tale of Kingdoms 1.2.5 mod, the 1.25.5 version because the developer stopped working on it and that's the latest version there is and you can't play it on any other version so Minecraft so next I'll show you mod loader 1.2.5 because if I'm right it has to line up with the version of Minecraft that you need to run to play the mod so Mod loader one point two point five and it is the this link the one that's like OLGH.net 
end make sure you click this link I'm pretty sure no no it's this one uh, I'm pretty sure I'll double check later I'll leave this tab open in case I got it wrong Okay, drag that into our mods folder. I think that's the right one, so. If it's wrong, I'll go back and fix it. So now, got that. We need magic launcher. Wow. Alright, just the first link, and... Scroll down, it'll say Windows, Mac, blah, blah, blah. Click on Windows if you have Windows. I don't know if this will work on a Mac, so. I have Windows 7, so. If you have a Mac, I have no idea if this will work. Oh, yeah, and all these stupid ads, ignore them and click on this. Save. Err, pop-ups. And then put that in there. Actually, you don't have to. You can put it on your desktop, but do whatever you want with that. And then finally, we need the actual Tale of Kingdoms 1.2.5 mod. Pretty sure it's this one. Yeah. And scroll down until you see this. That's the link you want to click. And it'll just pop up. Say download. Make sure it says unofficial Tale of Kingdoms version 1.3.0, even though it's actually 1.2.5. Updated by arconic.zip. Save. And then we'll put that in our, no, we'll put that in our Minecraft Mods folder. Alright, now, since there was no Minecraft on here, I'll have to get that set up real quick. I'll do that real fast. I do the wrong password? I think I did. Yeah. Wait for that to download. There we go. Got it running. <clears throat> now what you do is Open the MC Nostalgia, make sure it's the file, not the zip folder. And go to the bin folder. No, don't go there. Go to MC Nostalgia, make sure it's the application file. Open it, say run, you press enter. And if you go up the list to 1.2.5, it tells you at the bottom to enter the number of the version you want to run it in so type in 91 for 1.2.5 so 91 and press enter it'll start and we'll be running in minecraft 1.2.5 next time we start now what you do go back to here Open Magic Launcher and click on Setup. And you see here it says Minecraft Jar 
1.2.5 so now we're running 1.2.5 and say add because you want to add a mod actually two go to desktop if that's where you saved your mod stuff like I did minecraft mods first add the mod loader and it should say okay if it doesn't then go back and see what you did wrong or maybe it just won't work I don't know and then you add the unofficial tale of kingdoms v1.3.0 good it says okay now you can say okay and log in oh yeah right remember me log in okay create new world I think you have to create a new world for this mod I'm not sure if you can start a previous world but I don't know you'd have to find out for yourself so Tale of Kingdoms. Let's make the seed. Tale of Kingdoms 1.2.5. Create new world. Yeah, it worked. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, start new conquest. Hey. Okay. There we go. You got it. If you turn around, see the guild is right there. Yeah, we did it. To be honest, I wasn't sure if this was going to work a second time, but it did. So I hope you guys enjoy, and I really hope it works for everyone. I know it's probably not going to work for everyone, but I really hope it does. See you guys next time.